and today we're going to be doing another tutorial. I don't know what it's going to I think it's just a Minecraft tutorial. I need a new no. thumbnail for this. Yeah, yeah, I have a series that I stopped. Was, I think was it was, power. No, it was called Minecraft Tutorials. I don't know if you guys remember that, but um, I'm going to be doing another episode for that one because this doesn't really fall under redstone because there's no redstone. So, um, yeah, so today we're going to be doing something special. And uh, what that is is water um, water flowing. So um, these apply some very special water physics. Um, so it's going to be a bit hard. Not that hard, but it's going to... It's gonna be pretty easy, actually. And I'm um, doing this in my special world. Um, I, as you guys know, I like decorating, so I just put in this very starch, bright white carpet for no reason, and um, this lava here, and the stone thing. Okay, so for this, you'll need a bucket of water, a sandstone slab, smooth sandstone, sign, um, and another block is optional, and glowstone is also optional. Um, you don't need sandstone, you can, any block is fine, and you need a half slab of any sort, but that's fine too. Um, so let's get this stuff out here. And you don't, again, you don't need this other block, you only need one block of one sort, and then another, and then a half slab. You don't need this other block, but I'm just, I just have it for no reason. Okay, so, um, and, uh, let's get started. So, this door here, that I have here, I just decided to put it in because, um, if you guys don't trust me, for my smartness, here you go. This is some kind of smart. So, if you want to learn how to do this, as the sign says, click on that video over there, and it's going to be popping up right about now. And it's going to be like right on the right somewhere. So just click on it, and um, if you want to watch this, it was a very old version, like old video that I made. So ex just don't mind my bad recording stuff. But uh, let's get a move on here. So. Um, yeah, don't, that's just, okay, so, this is basically what it looks like, so, it looks a bit messy, I know there's water everywhere, but, um, right, uh, what, basically what we're doing is making water flow up, so, if you've ever seen any videos that make the water go, like, weirdly, I guess, or go up in a mob spawner, I guess, um, you could, and you don't know how to do it, well, this, you're at the right place, so. So what we're basically doing here is, uh, I'm going to come over here and build it, so let's get a little bit far away. So what we're doing is basically um, using water uh, efficiently so that you can get more out of it. So uh, if you guys do not know, water flows for 8 blocks, exactly 8 blocks. So um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, we're going to go 1 block over and stop it. Well, we don't need to stop it, so I'm just going to prove it to you guys where it's gonna stop so we're putting water here we're not counting this one all right so this is just the back so it won't spill that way so let's count one two three four five six seven eight and it's and like I said before it water spans a total of eight blocks start including the block that you place it on and this is the ninth block so we don't need it it's not gonna go anywhere okay so this is eight blocks so how we utilize this is when we come over here and we build it what we're basically doing is making water well i'm just going to use that one that we've already had so um when it stops right here we can make it continue flowing farther by simply placing a block there and placing a block here you know, uh, i'm just going to use this one so you guys can tell uh this is so that you can tell the sign is there so if you're gonna like remodel or whatever, you won't break it and the water won't spill everywhere. But that's the only reason why I'm using a different block. So you place a sign. Uh, this is a sign, and then we put water here. So like that, and it won't flow sideways. For I don't know why, but it just doesn't. So just cover this up, and we can keep going with eight blocks. So starting from this block. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, and because, and if you guys do not know, also, if the higher it is, the more, the longer the length. So this, since this is a bit one block taller, it's going to go one block farther. So we're just going to block it up like that, and it stops right here. And then you can simply place this as right here on the last block. It does not matter if it's 
on the last water part or if it's in the middle as long as it's um on the water like if you place it oh no 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 it still works even if you place it here and if i do this again put the special block place that there and place water and it's still gonna go up and and i'll prove you guys how this is, it works because i'm just gonna get in the water here the water's gonna push me this way and this weird current's gonna happen it's gonna push me over and i'm gonna keep going this way forever unless i choose to stop it somewhere and it's gonna stop right here so that's basically how it works and you can continue this train anywhere long as long as you want and um, as like I said before, you can place something like right here, and place a sign, and then place water, and it's gonna keep going. And now you can make it kind of like wavy. It's gonna go up, then down, then up, then down, and that's how it works. So, yep. So that's basically what we're applying here. And th these are several ways of using it. I came up with three, four-ish, three, four-ish. Uh, it doesn't matter. You could too. And um, uh, also, I'm going to include the link to this piston door in the description below. So, um, yeah. Oh, hey, look, squids are coming in. I did not put those there. They just came in. Squid died. Okay, okay. So the next thing we're doing, we're I'm gonna show you guys is the horizontal beltway, quote quote, or the train. And um, obviously it looks not like a train, but you can make it look like a train. And it works efficiently because, let me show you why. Yeah, so this working like the thing I just showed you guys, um, it just uses this up, down, up, down thing to make you go forward and forever and ever. Of course it goes slower, way, I mean very slow. So, I mean if you're short in iron, this is a very cheap way to make it. But if you do have a lot of iron, I suggest rail because this is not what you want to spend your day doing okay so this is a water slide um using the same physics as this one except it goes up so um as i said before it does not matter um where you place the slabs and stuff so the water is right here it's one block separation to the slab you start the water here two blocks slab two blocks slab two blocks so the beginning one uh i i made it two blocks yeah and then yeah so on so you get the point and then this one is um a slide and you can read the signs and laugh ha 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 okay okay no no but this is a slide and i did the same thing two blocks you cannot do it with one block and i tried this already if i'm if you don't believe me i'm gonna show you uh, let me set the time to day Alright, so placing this here. Oh shoot, so bright. Sorry about that, guys. Okay, so let's do this. Okay, okay, okay. That's my brother. Okay, um, we're gonna place lava here. Wait, why did I say lava? Uh, water here. And then we're gonna try to put a slab here. And then. What the heck? Oh, nice. Alright, so with this. And if you place the sign here and the water here, it does not work, as you can tell, because this water is not flowing. And when it's not flowing, there's no flow, obviously. So you have to always have one block separation. So I have to move this over one, of course, and now it's flowing. And now we can place the block with the sign on it. And then the waters will flow. And this is the maximum you have to, you can only do. So you can set, put a slab here and a sign here. Whoops, nope, nope. You can't do that. Nope, you gotta move it one over. That's that's yeah. That's exactly what I did over there. So like that, and then you know the sign goes right here. Place it, and then the water, and then that's how it works. So yeah, keep that in mind because if you try to do it like me, it's gonna water's gonna start flowing everywhere with the one block. So uh, it says jump here. We jump in. This is our my slide, and there are many ways to do this. And you can do this if you're making some kind of fun amusement park on your server or world, or if you're planning to do something crazy for the kids or whatever. You know, you, you make the slide, and then basically what I have here, what I've done here is make the slide go up, and then at the top. 
uh, it switches down. So when you go down, there's no need for anything fancy schmancy. You know, just make it a slope. And I just put slabs there because it looks nice. And then you make it go down and it stops. But the fun doesn't end there. If you want it to keep going, just break this slab and then break this block and then make it go back to the beginning so so it comes here the water stops because of the sign you drop in and then make the water flow this way and then do the same physics as you did before so just make it go up and then you can add more stuff to make it more bumpy more fun you know the kids are young not forever though you know so I and mean, you know might as well take advantage of it so yeah make it go up and then at the corners you just make it normal and then it'll go the right way it'll go that way and then of course it redoes it again yeah it goes back through so that's how you do it um, you have to make it turn though because it if you're wondering uh, it's it's impossible to have this go straight all the way back here because then you know you have to have something turn somewhere so you don't have to have this part turn you could have it go all the way over there over to here and then it has to come up and then turn and that's why it'll be ruined. So, oh no, no. Oh, okay. I'm back, guys. I have to take a phone call again. This is like every video I have to have a phone call. Okay. The last thing here is I have to show you guys is the AFK pool, and I have two versions. This is the small one, and this is the big one. And I'm gonna start with the small one, AFK pool, banned on most so some servers. So a lot of servers uh, don't mind that, guys. I just had a mini experiment with something, so don't mind. Um, this is the AFK pool, hooray! And then this guy says, "I'm a sign." No, screw you, sign. Okay, so uh, this is an AFK pool, and most servers ban it because they have a thing called time limits. If you guys are not time limits, time yeah. ranking. And if you're not familiar with that. It's basically when you have to stay on the server for a certain amount of time to rank up. And when you rank up, you get spe spe oh, hold on. special perms and special Spurs. items, kits, whatever. So they ban these because these give you time. And, you know, you can do AF slash AFK and then you just be sitting there and coining time while you're away having fun playing golf or whatever. Um, yeah, so that they obviously want you to waste your life more than, you, than they care about your life. So... Uh, basically what you do is you jump in and then the water flow moves you around and you don't you just sit there and you know this way it some servers kick people for being AFK too long this way you're not being AFK because technically you're still moving you're just not there so this is not a hack um, this is not a cheat it's not a hack definitely so um, this is not magic it's not sorcery or black magic or sure. Voodoo. Mm. It's not none of that magic, okay? This is all legit, and it's all by done with Minecraft physics. So, so you can do it too, and you can fool your friends and make them creepy and cry to, at night because they're scared of you. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. Um, moving on. This is the large FK pool, and it's ideal for big servers, meaning servers with lots of people. And my squid, there are squids in my thing, which is not intention. Um, so this is where the glowstone comes in. You can put glowstone on any of these things. Um, I put glowstone in the slide because it was dark, and you don't want kids dying by mobs. As you can tell, there glowstone right here. No, you don't. That's dangerous. Okay. Um, yeah. I mean, if they die, you're gonna be responsible for them. <laughs> okay, but uh, this is the large AFK pool, and my squids are having fun, but. I don't want them there. So you plop in like the the small one, and then you have these corner things with the slabs, and they just push you around on and on and on and on. And it's very simple to make, um, just like the other stuff. Uh, the reason why I didn't show you guys how to make these is because I you get the point, you know. Just, yeah, don't mind that. Uh, I already showed you how to do it. It's really simple, you know. You just have one block, blah blah blah, and then yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys again. Okay, so. Last recap, you close it off right like this so the water doesn't flood your house and then you put it, the water right there and then on the block right before the slab you place something smooth or anything, you place a sign um, and you write I, I sign, you have to put it exactly, I comma sign in all caps, am a Yeah, just M-A. No, no, no. You gotta say M-A-Moose, okay? 
I sign am a moose. That that's how you say it. And then you put it here, and then you put. I'm just kidding, guys. Don't don't do that. No, just don't do that. You don't have to write anything on your sign. Okay, so place water here. The water won't go sideways as, as long as you just keep blocking it up. And then that's basically it. And then you just you know repeat this little section here. So you, then you do uh, if you want to be uh, like whatever you call it, a symmetrical, whatever, one, two, and then you place a slab right here, and then, you know, keeping two blocks from between every slab, one, two, one, two, one, two, so on. And then you place a sign here, water, and then you keep going on. If you want to go uphill, easy, like I said right here, you just go, this, you just do the same concept, except you go up. So, after I place the slab right here, and then I can put my blocks there, and I, of course you have to expand the walls otherwise it's going to flood your house like that and then you put 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 a block no nope, put a block right there and then a slab nope slab and then you put water and then don't forget your signs and yes that's how you do it so I'm going to show you guys again so right I'm going to show you guys the section right here I have my slab nope nope I have my slab and I have my sign to block the water it's going to come over two blocks my slab my sign slab I mean two blocks slab sign two blocks slab sign sign yeah so same thing with the AFK pool um you just have a water some water things so, oh shoot no okay so I it looks like I forgot a sign right here and my oh shoot and my slab so I'm gonna put and the your slab there there we go so and then you yeah I just show you guys basically how to do it so you just place a sign place a sign place a slab place water and then you do it for all four corners and that's how you do it and it just moves on and on and on like that so uh, that's it for this video thank you guys for watching um, I will probably put out another video sometime next no in two weeks because I am going to Florida woohoo for summer so for two weeks or a week yeah so probably won't be posting there because the last time I went there I just didn't have good internet access probably won't be posting or doing anything really what is that what is that stuff around you the fences their fences the oh oh well, that's cool okay yeah so uh thank you guys for watching and uh don't forget to like comment rate subscribe and i'll see you guys next time